there are right now, at the moment, two Nintendo prototypes floating around the internet claiming to be the next revolutionary Nintendo console, but which one of these is going to be the next breakthrough console like the first Switch was? Now, fans are very disappointed with what Nintendo has delivered to the gaming community over the last five years. While the Switch OLED was a better version of the original, it ultimately failed to bring anything new to the market. Although this year, Nintendo seems to be striking back with releasing a new format for the 2D Mario franchise and another sequel to Zelda. Today we will be looking at which one of these so-claimed next Switches is more realistic and probable for the future of gaming. A majority of the people play their Switch on the TV, since the screen is so much bigger and it's a better experience. I mean, who can play for hours on end on this tiny screen? It just gets annoying. While you can say it's improved with the OLED, many would disagree. So it wouldn't be surprising if Nintendo came out with a brand new home console. They would be a direct competitor to PlayStation and Xbox, but we all know that Nintendo's strongest points are the handheld gaming. Handhelds are the key part of the company. Changing to TV only could ruin their entire brand image and the reinventing theme Nintendo wants to bring to gamers. And counting in that Nintendo hasn't done anything like this since the Wii U all the way back in 2012, this is probably not a good choice to make for Nintendo. But should you remove the TV mode from the next console completely? Changing back to only handheld feels like taking a step back and removing the countless possibilities it brings with it. Mario Party and other games enjoyed on the big screen would be eliminated completely, so this is very unlikely, but still this could be tempting. The next Nintendo console should keep its format. A crossing between a handheld and a home console is what Nintendo invented and should stick with. But we can all agree that Nintendo needs to step up their game and improve drastically to make another impact in the gaming industry. Since the release of the PlayStation 5, Nintendo has had a slow decline in Switch buyers and players, so if they don't intervene now, they will be wiped out and turned into a thing of the past. But that's enough for today. I'm very happy I'm back on the channel making new videos, but I'm getting bored of myself already. So subscribe to see more, give a like for the YouTube algorithm, and I will see you in the next one.